Hello everyone, in today's video, I am going to be discussing how to know your fertile window. Whether you are looking to conceive or just tracking your fertility for deeper health insights, understanding your fertile window is essential to achieving your goals. But before getting started, if you are new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe so that you can keep following our videos on health and well-being. So here we start today's video. The first step in understanding your fertile window is to learn about your menstrual cycle. Generally, a menstrual cycle lasts 28 days. During this time, your body and more specifically your uterus goes through four stages. The next stage is to discuss is what your fertile window is and why it matters. Your fertile window is the sixth day period of the month when your chances of conception are the highest. When trying to get pregnant, having a good understanding of your fertile window is the best way to maximize your chances of success. So, how do you know when your fertile window is? One of the most common indicators of ovulation and your fertile window is your basal body temperature. Each morning, you should measure your BBT and record this number on your calendar. Over the course of the month, your BBT will fluctuate and reach its highest point just before ovulation. This temperature spike can last up to 3 days and indicate that your fertile window is open. Another way to track your fertile window is through cervical mucus. Around the time of ovulation, your cervical mucus will become thinner, clearer and more abundant. This will be the time when you are most fertile. And finally, some women choose to use an ovulation predictor kit. These kits detect the LH surge hormone just before ovulation. By testing once a day at around the same time each day, you can detect when this surge is occurring and better understanding your fertile window. Once you have a good understanding of your fertile window, there are a few things you should keep in mind. Sperm can survive in the reproductive tract for up to 5 days. So you should be having intercourse in the three days preceding the ovulation. This will increase your chances of conception. It is important to keep in mind that your fertile window is just a six day window and everyone's cycle is different. Knowing your personal cycle is the best way to maximize your chances of conception and get the health information you are looking for. So that's it for today. Hopefully today's video has given you a better understanding of your fertile window and how best to track it. Good luck. Take care. Bye-bye.